Hi everybody, I'm Hub Arkish for ChicagoSunTimes.com and I know we promised you a preview of the playoff games this weekend but there is much bigger news in Chicago as the Chicago Bears, George McCaskey and Ted Phillips have pretty much shocked Bears Nation with the announcement that they've hired a new general manager and his name is Ryan Pace, formerly of the New Orleans Saints. Now there is nothing shocking about Pace's candidacy. He is highly qualified, appears to be an excellent choice. He's just not somebody that was on the Bears radar, particularly when so many people thought that the job had been pretty much wired for Chris Ballard, the player personnel director of the Kansas City Chiefs. It's interesting that both Ballard and Pace interviewed with the Bears on this past Wednesday. The reason everybody thought it would be Chris Ballard? Well, because 12 of his 14 years of NFL experience were with the Chicago Bears. That's where he got started in the NFL. Ryan Pace, on the other hand, has spent all of his 14 years in the NFL with the New Orleans Saints. So what are the principal differences here? Well, if you're trying to clean house, if you're trying to get a fresh start, if you want to do things differently, why would you hire a guy who has all of his experience working for the people who got it wrong over the last decade plus? That's who Chris Ballard was. It's unfortunate because Chris Ballard is a quality GM candidate. He probably will get a job in the next couple of years. He just didn't feel right for the Chicago Bears and the fresh start they're going for. Ryan Pace, on the other hand, is perfect for it. There is a little bit of a local connection. Even though he's originally from Texas, he played his college football at Eastern Illinois University, finishing up as the captain of the team in 1999. He also, while he was with the New Orleans Saints in 2008, was put through a Stanford business management program designed for NFL executives and assumed to fast track these young men for general manager jobs. He's had experience running the player personnel department. Everything about him seems to be a perfect fit for what the Bears want to do. Just 37 years old, bright new ideas, and a guy who the Saints general manager Mickey Loomis calls a surefire thing as a general manager. Here's the one other thing that Ryan Pace has that Chris Ballard didn't have. He's got a Super Bowl ring. He was part of the organization that built that New Orleans Saints 2009 Super Bowl team. He comes with almost everything you would want. The other candidates, Brian Gain, of course Lake Dawson who the Bears interviewed, it was a good list. But it appears that the Bears got it right this time. And hats off to George McCaskey. A lot of people thought he would make the easy choice. Ballard was the easy choice. But apparently George McCaskey is serious about a fresh start, about a new focus, about a new way to run the Chicago Bears. Are there any guarantees with this? Of course not. Most general managers never get to the Super Bowl, let alone win one. But the Bears went out and found one of the most highly qualified young men they could. And again, they've signaled complete change. Things are going to be done differently here in Chicago going forward. Next up, obviously, the head coaching hire. It could come very quickly. No word on where Pace was at in terms of his conversations with the Bears as to whether he had a choice already made or somebody he at least wanted to recruit as hard as he could when he got here. That, again, should happen fairly quickly now that the GM job has been filled. That's it on the Bears general manager news for now. But for the best in sports, 24 hours a day, seven days a week, stay right where you're at at ChicagoSunTimes.com.